let's quickly talk about the include keyword in MQL5. The include keyword allows you to include functions, classes, variables, and other code snippets inside your expert advisor or custom indicator. All this reusable code has to be stored in .mqh files. These can be found inside the include folder right here. For example, let's include the object .mqh file. Let's go up here to the global scope and let's say include and inside brackets you say file name in this case object dot mqh you can save it and compile it as you see it worked well and what the include keyword basically does is when the preprocessor runs over your code this line right here will be replaced with everything that is in the object.mqh file. But there's another option of including mqh files in your expert advisor or custom indicator. Instead of using these square brackets, you can also use quotation marks. To do so, you just write the name of the file.mqh inside quotation marks. However, this approach only works when the mqh file is stored in the same folder as your expert advisor or your custom indicator, which is usually not the case. To create a new mqh file to store your reusable code, you can click on the new button and select include. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.